Hello, my name is Abe. Welcome back to the Binding of Isaac Repentance. Do not continue the last run. We can't even move. Uh, although it was technically a victory. Let's play, you know, let's play as a Forgotten. The game didn't like us clicking into the Forgotten, but hey, we can play as the Forgotten ourselves and say that, you know, this is all intentional. Yeah. Oh, I wanted to try to push it, but I didn't want to get hurt because uh, HP is very, very hard to come by as the Forgotten. It seems like lately, at least, my my Forgotten, maybe my Blue Baby runs as well, have been mostly hitting a wall with, with being able to do reliable damage and also just not having uh, a whole lot of health. So in a situation like this, I just don't want to risk anything. You can do it. Okay, well, you kind of did it. Uh, but we're gonna try to play as the Lost. Not the Lost, oh my god, thank god we're not playing as the Lost. We're gonna try to play as the Forgotten here and see what kind of nonsense we can complete here. I didn't even see you, but really, as long as the Forgotten down here is just smacking flies, that's all I want him for. Beautiful. Okay, any super tinted rocks? I don't even have any bombs, so it's not like we can really do anything about them if we see them. But it's worth it's worth keeping your eye open, you know. I'm gonna stop like throwing you everywhere. <laughs> it's probably a bit of a negative to like throw you into chests and throw you into doors and everything, but it's just so much fun. It's the only fun I can have is this guy. Just throw him into everything. You know what we need? Um, tears up plus knockback shot. I, it's like Sagittarius, I think. That would be good to have because I, I should probably try to utilize more knockback as this guy, but you know, you just gotta find the item. Stuff doesn't really show up all the time. Caffeine pill. You know what? I'm not gonna use it immediately. Maybe that's another like positive thing about my runs recently is I haven't been just using all pills all the time. I didn't even see the item room. <laughs> so maybe we need to like stop using so many freaking pills. Maybe we just let the pills chill. You know, who needs pills all the time? Strength. You know what? Full health. Doesn't do anything, but at least we know that it's there. I actually do like the, uh, you know, that the pickaxe is actually pretty, pretty okay. I actually like the, uh, the poop item. To have some additional poop familiars helps quite a lot. Uh, here's a question. Do they follow me or do they follow the, the, the body? They follow the body, which makes total sense, but I was curious. So we can create a line of poops which will follow the body and possibly do damage to enemies that are, are in the room. So I think that's the, the bright side here. Oh, I didn't see that, but at least we got it. What's the point of saving a pill? If you get like a PhD, you'll identify the pill. So why not get a PhD and then maybe have a identified pill? King Baby. King Baby is actually very good. So I'm gonna take a King Baby if we can get it. it. It allows me to do damage with familiars from any point on the screen, so I think it's actually just like an absurdly good item. It's one of those items that got really, really buffed in, in Repentance. The fact that it auto-targets is just, just beautiful. 120 volt. Also pretty good because it does damage around you, so in theory, one at a time, in theory, this allows us to throw the head at enemies and still do damage to them even if the head kind of misses a little bit, the head throw. So I kind of like it. I kind of like a lot of, of what we got going on here. I kind of like it. A free key, I mean, We'll take it, because it's a key. 
la, 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 la. We do have a possibility of a deal. Oh, what the heck? Where are we? We do have a possibility of a deal with the devil on this floor. Question is, do we want to take it? Poops! They're dying on the spikes! Freaking dumb poops. 48 hour energy. I wonder why sometimes he doesn't actually say the line. I like it when he says the line. Yeah, so if, if we miss and enemies are just outside of our range, we can still kill them. It's also like a little bit of chain lightning, so it's it's pretty okay. I do wish that the freaking poops would stop running into everything, though. I hate how... <laughs> Anything that's that's friendly targets me. Anything that's a familiar, or a, an enemy rather, uh, targets the bones. We should have let that guy spawn a lot of bombs. Uh, should we go with a deal with the devil? Dude, honestly, if we get like a little brimstone, we'd be extremely happy with that. So I think maybe we'll try it. I don't really like what we got though. Guppy's head is interesting, because it, it is an active item. Hold up, hold up. Hold up. Bomb beggar is infinite bombs with safety scissors, says Connie. Dude, that's such a good a good trick. That's totally, totally perfect. Curse of the Tower would be amazing. Curse of the Tower is good. Also, um, I mean, we had a run with Anarchist Cookbook with this trinket and you, we got to 99 bombs. Um. TTV Choran, welcome to the stream. How you doing? You've started playing Isaac this week. It is a fun game. Sorry, I'm thinking. I'm thinking about Guppy's head because it's gonna cost us three HP, but the flies are pretty good at helping us to kill enemies. But the flies are gonna be orbiting the body, not the not the soul. So, oh my God, if we, uh, I don't, I don't think we take it. I don't think we take it. I think we want to wait. And uh, multi-dimensional baby has like some negatives with this, like anti-synergies. But I think we want to wait, honestly, for a better deal with the devil or familiar. Like if we get a seraphim, that's pretty good because we can always seraphim. Uh, oh, black rune. We can always seraphim and. Oh, all those familiars are dying. Oh. Why are you approaching the bones, by the way? You, you're not even approaching me. You have no idea what you're doing. Uh, with Seraphim, I can finish my train of thought here. Uh, we can have it auto fire in a particular direction, so that's actually pretty good for us with King Baby. I mean, this is why we bought it. Really, though, we do want Brimstone. And I, I mean, I know I could have always picked up the Guppy's head to keep the deal with the devil precedent, but I don't think that's actually perfectly necessary. And dude, I would really like to get into that boss trap room now. Mother's tattoo is an insanely good item. To get two items out of a boss trap room by doing it, that's like, that's great value, but there's no way of getting in there right now. Fish head, I don't think fish head works with poop. Yeah, and I'm, I'm loving 120 volt right now because we're obviously getting some like weird chaining happening. And it's it's certainly helping. Ooh, the poop trinket is also good. There's so many good choices on this floor. Da -ging. I think uh, I think poop trinket might actually beat the scissors. Oh my God. Uh, to be able to get a lot more money out of the poops that are going to be spawning is pretty good. Uh, the the item that we have, the poopy familiars, dirty mind. It also makes some rocks turn into poops. So we will get poops over the course of the run, even on floors that don't normally have poop. So it kind of feels like an okay uh, choice here. What the hell? Oh my god, please don't do that ever again. Oh lord. Rock beat scissors? It's not a rock, it's more like poop beat scissors. In this weird situation. 
You can't move, you can't move. You're stuck in the poop. Uh, I don't really know how this affects us that much, but we'll take it. What the heck is this, the stars? Dude, the stars is actually incredible. We'll lose a speed up, who cares? I mean, actually, we should do it in this room. Look, I'm gonna take it. Uh, yeah, so I'm gonna stars immediately. <sighs> really? You're gonna give me this garbage? This doesn't even do anything. This doesn't really do anything. And this doesn't really help us all that much. So I think we kind of lucked out. Uh, well, we the opposite, we didn't luck out, we lucked down. But all we lost was a speed upgrade, so it wasn't that bad. But we, we pretty much got garbage out of that, unfortunately. Well, that's a shame. I was really hoping that we would get some good items. To get two free deal with the angel items and have them be the sword. <laughs> and, uh, oh, uh, no, we have a key, okay. And the other thing was pretty bad. You know, uh... This will only blank rune once, or black rune once. Give me whatever this is, holy water. That's actually, I would prefer holy water probably to most of the other things that we had. Although I don't know if it's gonna work with King Baby. Hopefully it does. Uh, okay, let's find the fire. Was it in here? It was in here. I can, I can just go through. We can just go through. We don't even have to be the soul in order to go through. I had no idea. I'm learning so many things about this game today. Nuns Habit can break the run in a lot of good ways. It's not a bad item, but considering we don't have any active items, it, it isn't amazing. It's not that fantastic. Why am I not getting hit, by the way? I didn't get hit when I touched the chest. This seemed weird. Not entirely certain what's going on, but if we've broken the game somehow and we're invincible because of the fact that we like broke the forgotten on the last run, I'll be I'll be happy with it, I guess. Yes, get closer. Get closer to me. Electricity. Really? Oh, there you go. I like the, the one laser that kills him. Are you invincible while carrying your bones? No, you are not! Maybe it's bugged? Oh, you freaking jerk! Oh, God, I hate these chests. When did I unlock these? I wanna go back. Go back in time. No, you're not invincible when you're carrying the bones. I don't know why we're getting, like, the weird luck that we're having, though. You know, I'd, I'd probably still rather have this. Just for the money, honestly. Well, that was weird. <laughs> Dude, I hate these haunted chests. They are actually garbage. Every single time I've seen one so far, I've just walked into it. I don't want to have to learn a new color of chest that I have to avoid from now on. <laughs> I'll use my last key on this. And get pretty much nothing, but that's okay. Alright, let's get the heck out of here. I really do wish that we could go into that, uh... Oh god, it even works if you throw your bones. I do wish we could go into that uh, room, but unfortunately we can't. And we still have the void too, I guess we didn't use it yet. I guess really as this character, it's hard to, it's hard to accept getting rid of so much health to take advantage of those boss trap rooms, because you really do have to get rid of a lot of HP if you're gonna do it. Looking for a key. Emperor. Emperor is not bad, but I'd still rather keep the black rune. You got any tips for beginners apart from apart from staying on hard mode? If you're a beginner, you probably should not be on hard mode. You should probably be on one of the easier difficulties, which does matter slightly, you know, increases health drops and stuff like that. 
Otherwise, you know, just... It's, it's a hard game. It's a very hard game. It's gonna take a while. It's gonna take a lot of practice. There's not too much tips to be given. Look up items if you don't know what they do. <laughs> Sometimes you get screwed by some of the item combinations. Uh, yeah, this is a this is a fine enough combination. Let's get the heck out of here. Mega Satan is tainted lost. Yeah, that makes sense. We did that recently. Uh, freaking haunted chests. I guess if if you're gonna have a golden chest. I guess it makes sense that you have a haunted chest, too. You can't have a good chest without a bad chest. Did I get him? I think I froze him. He was just underground. I need a key. I wonder, do these uh, golden poops give me... Eh, it's still worth it. Do these golden poops give me money when they die? Lovers. This is bone hearts. Ah, uh, but we can't utilize the bone hearts at all, but I guess you still use it. Oh, no. Lovers. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> Lovers gets rid of two spirit hearts in order to spawn items. Oh, God. Well, um... Oh, Lord. That was not the rune I thought it was. Hero font is the bone hearts. Well, on the bright side, we're gonna get a lot of stats out of these. So, we traded a lot of HP for some stats. Don't know if I would make that choice all the time. Uh, we're now pretty much almost dead. And now we are pretty much almost dead. Oh Lord, the tarot cloth screwed me on that one big time. I've got no health remaining. <laughs> Oh, it wasn't Bone Hearts. It wasn't Bone Hearts at all! At least our damage is a lot better. I should be careful with where you uh, are standing when the room ends. Uh, let's keep exploring. I, I, I guess at this point I am just hoping to kill enemies quickly and try to get some hearts back. It's not really that bad because we can always just get the health again. But why did, why did that cause me to lose four bone hearts? That's what I'm curious about. I lost a lot of health from that. <laughs> I lost eight spirit hearts and they turned into four bone hearts. You guys hoping for a confessional? Um, that would remove the, the broken hearts, but it's not gonna give me health. And right now the thing that I need is health. I know I have tarot cloth. I, I didn't expect the lovers to take... I, I did not expect the lovers to give me two bo broken hearts. I expected it to give me one broken heart, which means that I didn't expect it to double to four. I expected it to double to two. And even then, I didn't even expect it... Oh, uh, you know, we should definitely do this room now. In the And I also didn't expect it to even give me any broken hearts. I thought it would give me bone hearts. So just a lot of... I didn't expect it to do this, or this, or this, or this, or this, but I guess I haven't really had too many opportunities to use the lovers, have I? Well, we will take synth oil. I, why that way? Honestly, our damage is, is very good right now. Oh, we also did get... Um, a... a... orbital. <laughs> it's not a good orbital. We have to fire bullets to make anything of it, but we do have the, uh, angelic prism now. I... How did I get angelic prism? Oh, I thought we picked up, um... This might sound stupid, I thought we picked up Glyph of Balance from the angel room a while ago. I didn't realize it was this. What a shot. I'm loving the King Baby shots with, um... With the, uh, Holy Water, because it just auto-aims. Thanks for ruining my bomb.
And at this point, I'm gonna take pills, because I, I really need, like, a health up. Health. Up. Also, I'm out of poop. This is a, this is a wonky run. <laughs> uh, really need to find some health pretty soon. This is also a very weird floor. There wasn't really that much. Well, I'll take the money. What is on the next floor? Mines? Uh, I don't really want to go to the mines, so we'll stick to the depths. Please? Poops? I need the poops. They're my best friend right now. They're my only friend right now. Please, poops, help me! I've killed myself on this run, help me! Ah, oh, that's fine. I was, I was actually... I was thinking we had a good chance at, at this run, like we had a lot of health? Okay, damage? And now I'm like, oh god, I have one HP! <laughs> The little monster is fine. Again, he's gonna auto fire with King Baby, so that's like a, a a pretty good get, honestly. Anything that auto fires with King Baby is gonna be a premier pickup, because it means that I can do damage pretty much at range, no matter where I am. We'll go back for that key. Don't worry. Don't you worry. Because, for instance. The little monstro is just gonna be shooting, 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 shooting. His little, uh, his little heart out. Heart out. He's gonna shoot his heart out. Come here, guys. Oh! It's beautiful! It's beautiful! Thank you, little monstro. You've given me a, a new sense of hope. Oh, it's HP! It's Curse of the Tower! Ah, uh, no. Uh, look, if we still had safety scissors, then maybe, but even then... I wouldn't be able to drop safety scissors if we took Curse of the Tower. Curse of the Tower is a bad item. It's a spirit heart, let's go. Take the tower? No. Maybe if I get another stars card. Right, I gotta go back to this guy in order to use bombs. Oh, it's so much HP. Oh, we are clawing our way back! I don't want to do that room for just a standard chest. Gold chests, maybe. Super tinted rocks, trying to look for. I guess I do have to stop shooting in order for King Baby to move. I accidentally pressed the bomb button, but we got some items, including the hero font. All right, that's extremely good luck. Thank you, accidental E key. My poor babies. Not my babies! It's another spirit heart! Also, what the heck is this? I, I mean, I gotta look, because if I don't look... I'll be annoyed when it doesn't work. Tainted Forgotten. It does work. Recall ability, huh? Let's see what it does. Birthright, recall. Gains a recall ability. Okay. <laughs> Interesting. Does okay, does it does it hurt enemies when I use it? Or something? It just retrieves the, the bones from a distance. I'm curious if it does damage uh to enemies when I pass through them. It's a hard thing to test though. You know, maybe it's not a hard thing to test. 
Oh, it, I don't go to the bones, the bones come to me. Dude, that's amazing. Yeah, birthright pog on that one. That's, that's fantastic. So now we can recall our body from any distance. Excuse me. So if we ever want to uh, to re-aim it, we don't have to actually worry about walking in there, wading into enemies, and then getting ourselves nearly killed, just getting our body back. That's actually, like, really good. <laughs> Hold on, what floor are we on? Necropolis? That's actually, like, really cool, too. That's a fun little birthright effect. I'll be honest with you, it feels like this should just be a part of the character. It's 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 very fun. Uh It is health. And we will take a holy light. I don't really care about deals with the angel though, so I don't really feel like trying to get more of them. I I guess we'll fight you for the the key piece. Even though I'm still looking for like a, you know, I'm not gonna fight you because I really do want to get access to a. Uh, we're gonna, we're gonna. By the way, we're gonna do the negative on this one. Uh, we still have to do Mega Satan. Yo, can I get the keepies? Oh crap! <laughs> I really thought we didn't have to do it at all. I, I'm focusing way too much on the run as opposed to what we need to be doing. Because uh, I was thinking, I would really like. Oh, dude, what the heck? What does the tarot cloth version of this do? Don't teleport me into the the mom fight, the mom foot fight. Okay, it's just this. I was thinking maybe the tarot cloth version would actually give you an easier boss, which would technically screw you. But I, I didn't realize that we still have to actually do the... Uh, the Mega Satan fight, so we should definitely try, well, and get back into these deal with the angel rooms whenever possible, because I have screwed up. Let's try that again. Thank you. God, that's so nice. <laughs> it's such a nice feature. How the heck are we gonna get in there? Get those angel pieces. We do have a few floors to get it dealt with, but I have I have made a mistake. I have definitely made mistakes. Oh, you freaking jerk. Hanged man. Well, we definitely don't need that. The hanged man. The hanged man. We keep the hero font because it's uh it's been tarot clothed, so it will give us three, four spirit hearts, something like that. find Joker cards now. Man, the secret room is is very strangely placed, but I know where it is, so we might as well go for it. It is not there. Maybe I don't know where it, where it is. Yeah, I've got no freaking idea. All right, let's leave. No self-sacrifice room either. If there is a self-sac room and we get like a perks, that would also be, or a wafer would be amazing. That would be a very good uh, time to pick up what we need. Dude, you know, I, two HP to go down here. For an extra item room shop, I, I think I'm actually worth, worth? I think I'm actually willing to go down here. What do baby rainbow poops do? I don't know. I, honestly, don't know. Yoink! It does hit him on the way back, too. So the body does hit him on the way back. <laughs> it's such a useful little ability. Now here's a here's a question. It does hurt, okay. I was hoping to cheat the system, that is not how you do that. No spirit hearts. Oh, bomber bombs. 
Okay, so we need more health, because we did spend a little bit coming down here, but in theory, what we really just need is uh, those deals with the angels again, because I did screw it up. But honestly, like if we if we get a uh, a shoal victory, I'd still be happy. A little annoyed with myself for uh, for doing this the wrong way. I'd still be pretty damn happy with it though. Nothing, dude. We need an active item. That's what we need. All right. Hate the fight, but we'll try it. Excuse me, stop yelling. Don't take my boy, my body boy. <laughs> Range up. Well, it's something. No, 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 no. We're gonna be taking petrified poop from now on. I'm curious. Oh, no. I was like, what if we recall our body from another room? It doesn't work, because your body follows you to the other room, duh. Doi. Small rock. That's a very nice pickup. Dude, uh, also, freaking 120 volt. Extremely good at taking care of some of these enemies. Anything that's n in the vicinity of the body is just getting wrecked. Now, we don't have any other fly items, and the attack fly is kind of poo poo. So, thank you. So, I'm thinking we should take this. Pisces, tears up, plus knockback shot! That's the one I wanted! Sweet! Oh! You freaking jerk! It. Uh, it aggroed onto the body, and then it aggroed onto me. I guess it makes sense because it is another player. Technically, as far as the game is concerned, it is another player. So it just focused on the other player instead of me. Rarely does that happen though, but it always seems to happen when uh, it causes me to take damage. I'm gonna do it. You know what? Just just suck him up. Or call him. It's such a useful ability. It really does feel like this should just be a part of the character. Like, you could give it a higher cooldown. And then Birthright could just, like, lower the cooldown or something. But if it's a cool ability, I'm, I'm greatly enjoying this. It just gives you so much more... Uh, uh, <laughs> gives you so much more care and control over what you're doing. You joker. Okay, I can, ah, I can kill him now. I never expect enemies to move diagonally. Got him. Oh, it's freaking fire. Oh God, it's more fire. Just leave the room. Just ran into fire twice. Oh lord. I think we're almost done with this floor too. Which is a, a bit sad because I would have liked to have gotten some oh, more things out of it. But at least what we got out of it was things that we needed, anyways. Car battery. Dude, we need an active item. <laughs> That's what we need. Stars. Well, don't need it, so we'll take Hero Font. I mean, I guess we could take the uh, the boomerang to like lock down enemies, but I'm like, whatever. We don't really need the boomerang, do we? La la. La. Take magic skin. I mean, I guess we could take it, but I certainly don't want to use it. We've already used it four times, technically. In a shop. <laughs> of all things. 
Uh, I'm gonna pay you some money. I actually have a decent amount of bombs. Maybe we could play this bomb guy too? I'm sure someone will pay out. Dude, sad bombs? That was like an eight bomb sad bomb? That's a, that's an incredible deal. I wonder how they look. They look pretty good. Okay, okay. Our HP is looking fine now. We're, we're getting, getting our HP back. Not quite up to full, but we're getting there. Oh, that would have been a cool set if it was Sad Bomb, Brimstone Bomb. No deal with the devil on this floor. Maybe we'll get one on the next floor. And then maybe we'll be able to actually get the, uh, Oh, Curse of the Lost. Maybe we'll actually be able to get the knife pieces that I, I forgot about. Maybe we'll get like a dad's key or something. Been, I know we got one of those on the chest recently, but it's been a while since I've had one for like a, a early in the run. I would love to find a dad's key early in a run at some point. It just never happens. No hidden button. Uh, not being able to see the map is gonna make this awful. Um, 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 a little faster, please. <laughs> what the heck? Was he caught on a poop? What is happening? He's so slow. Oh, it's car battery. I've, I've created a mobile orbital. What the heck? <laughs> oh, he's, he's back. Are there any items that let you repair broken hearts? Or are they broken for the remainder of the run? There actually is a way to repair them. Uh, if you get a confessional, the confessional can let you repair them. I have no idea what's happening with this, uh, with this, by the way. I, I'd actually like it to return immediately, please. Seems to be an, a, a, an effect of car battery that makes it come back very slowly, but that's like really not what I want. That seems to be very broken. <laughs> like it seems like it's a bug, but it's it could be working as intended, and this is just how they intended it to work. It's just so slow. I mean, I, it's kind of cool though, because, oh, I gotta move. It means that you can throw it, recall it. It's, recall isn't working anymore? Oh no, there it goes. I don't know why it just wasn't working. Uh, and then when you recall it, you can still do damage by swinging it. Seems a little wonky though. Whatever, I don't want the poop that badly. So like, you just you just cycle around the enemies and they get hit by it eventually. I don't know, maybe it's completely intentional and this is how we should be using this now. I mean, it actually does seem pretty effective now that I'm looking at it. Yo, please no. This is so weird. Good, 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 good. Oh, I don't really want to donate. Uh, no. No greed, no greed. I will buy the Spirit Heart. We're back up to like essentially full health. I'll buy Pokego. And still just kind of waiting for an active item on this run. I mean, we've got car battery. We had the opportunity for uh, 4.5 volt, which could have been amazing if the item was like uh, Book of Shadows or something. Just need, just need an active item to show up now. Any, any active item. You know what? I should have taken Guppy's head. Oh, yeah, I didn't even freaking see you. You didn't spawn, you jerk. Oh, we have full health. That happened fast. Hierophant Black Rune. 
Uh, does Black Rune allow you to suck up items? Hold on. Black Rune Isaac. Black Rune. No, not Blank Rune. Black Rune. I don't think it allows you to suck up items that you were holding over your head. I think I tried to use that once before. I think you have to be using the Void. So if we buy 4.5 volt, we can't suck it up. I'm gonna keep the Hierophant then. Hello? I think the Hierophant is just better because it's just, you know, guaranteed HP for the future. Empty Heart. I don't think it actually does it. You know what? It doesn't do anything. So we should pick it up with Black Rune and suck it up. What it's supposed to do is it's supposed to give you uh, a little bit, it, it gives you one empty red heart container if you're down to one red heart container. But since we don't have red hearts, it doesn't work. So we're just gonna suck this one up. It's another speed and tier upgrade, which is fine. Just gonna, just gonna wait, I guess, thank you. No secret room. That's okay. Who freaking needs it, dude? I do. I do. Uh oh. No, this is what we want. Okay. Charm Frowning Gaper up here is. Oh, Lord! Recall. Stop hitting my poops. Okay, there's the boss fight. Don't want the boss fight yet. Oh, don't be careful about that. We don't want the boss fight yet, though, because I, uh, I think we have gone to the shop. We have not been to the item room. It's another King Baby familiar, which is probably good, but we've been getting a lot of spirit hearts out of the poop. Maybe I have been to the item room on this floor already. I can't remember. I think we have. Maybe? I know the shop had nothing useful. Hey, disposable account. Welcome. How are you doing today? Yeah, the item or the shop had nothing really that useful. Oh, perfect jam. And I guess that does give us the best chance at the, uh, at the key piece, which is what we want. I freaking knew it. All right, let's see what we got. Bloody lust, I mean, look, what, whichever one that one is, it's probably not that good. We'll take glowing hourglass, which is actually incredible. Actually, actually a 10 out of 10. Now just don't get hit a whole bunch of times and then re-roll re time if you if you feel the need. Ah, that's a little dumb. Where's the, where's the exit? <laughs> it's over here. I'm just, I'm just, I just want to leave now. Nope. You get teleported two rooms back with car battery. I'm gonna imagine that it doesn't do anything with car battery. Although I have heard that there's a bug and if you use it on the same room twice without leaving a room that you can like duplicate familiars or some weird nonsense like that. So, you know, if we have batteries then maybe we can try that. Although we'd have to have like the battery, I think. Okay, this is the, the right path. No, go up, then right, then right. There it is, okay. Fantastic. Beautiful. We're gonna take some damage in all likelihood. 
But that really was not that bad. We're gonna take... We gotta take the negative, so we'll take the negative. We are fighting an angel, which is what we wanted! Because I actually do need these key pieces, so I'm glad that we were able to get at least one out of this. Although now we do need to get the other piece. Hopefully we do get it. We only have one floor to get it, though, unless we want to try to hit ourselves with a self-sacrifice room. That was still pretty good. Okay. We have mapping. Fantastic. I think this run has a very good chance of making it. Considering the ups and downs on this run, <laughs> I feel like we have a pretty darn good shot at it. And I gotta admit, 120 volt is doing more than I could have ever asked for. We have to take Sigil of Baphomet. It is too good. I'm loving the recall ability too. That's so much fun. Dice room. One. No. If I reroll this run right now, I'm not gonna have anything. I'm gonna have like no no synergies. I might still maintain recall, but I'm not gonna have much after that. Speed up. Worth? You know what? It was only a half speed up. I guess technically the game treats this as having two characters. Because with Jacob and Esau, uh, speed ups are halved because there's two characters. This is like the perfect floor now. Oh, what? Well, that's unfortunate. Uh, but this is like the perfect floor now for a... Uh, for a self-sacrifice room. But also, what does this, what does Incubus do? Well, you know what, we got the, we have the, uh, the hourglass. So you know what, let's figure out what Incubus does. It's just another bone. Although it also would probably auto-fire with King Baby. This actually seems pretty good. Um. I think we'll keep it, so we're not gonna, we're not gonna hourglass out. But I do hope that there is a self-sacrifice room. You know what? Unfortunately, King Baby does not work with Incubus. Incubus is not auto-firing, so... That's uh, a bit of a negative, but we still get the extra damage from the bones. From the baby itself, so it's it's still okay. I was hoping it would work where it would actually home in, but it's not. Excuse me, I need to pick you up to throw you through the door, please. Leave with the hourglass for a chance of a deal with the angel. Eh, you know, if we'll, I, we're pretty much reliant on a self-sacrifice room at this point. Cause I think even, even with the hourglass, I think it would have still locked in the deal with the devil, I think. So Bible, Book of the Dead, Book of Belial, how to jump, and Satanic Bible, which we have to take, because Satanic Bible gives us the health that we need in order to play a self-sacrifice room if one shows up, I think. <laughs> I'm loving the recall ability, it's so much fun. Yeah, I think we need this as opposed to the hourglass. Once you get hit three times, you can use the hourglass to restart a room with Nun's Cap, so you're immortal as long as you have four soul hearts. Soul heart says Dare Nunu. I guess that is true. We could just keep doing a, a, a fight infinite times. But I'm still gonna hold this at least for now. But that, that does give me something to think about. I mean, what do we have to do? Well, we have to do Shoal, which is really not that bad with the loadout that we have, I think. We have a lot of damage output. 
and the ability to recall our head. I think if we were doing Mega Satan, that might be the best option for us, but if we don't get the key piece, we can't even do it anyways. So I don't know, it's, it's a tough call. Because we also do get two spirit hearts whenever we use this because of the car battery. And I'd rather, I think I'd rather have just maximum health for the fight as opposed to having to try to do it without getting hit a few times. Because like, we are outputting a lot of damage. And luckily we didn't go up to the cathedral. <laughs> he was not paying attention. Hmm. Yeah, I think we're done. We have a lot of bombs though, so what if we... Oh, not gonna be here. What if we look for a secret room? It's not gonna be there, so it's gotta be here. I do hate that 120 volt seems to activate on familiars. <laughs> uh, don't need the HP? Don't have any other guppy items? I mean, it's it's actually tempting to pick up gup, uh, nine lives here because we could very quickly get back to full health just using Satanic Bible, so... I, you know, I think I'm actually gonna take it. It's probably a very dumb take. But like, in 10 rooms, we'll have full health anyways. And now we have nine lives. And I think, yeah, I think we're gonna, I think I'm gonna take this as opposed, the book rather, as opposed to the hourglass. Yeah, we could be invincible, uh, you know, as long as we have three HP because we could never die. But I think I'd still rather just have the, the, the total health. I think pseudo invincibility is highly overrated. I mean, you remember that run in which we were down here with nine lives? <laughs> Ironically enough. Ended up not really working out too well, did it? But on this run, we actually have way more damage than we ever had before. Dude, I love that you had the deep laser effect. So there's two HP. I also think that we should try and fully explore this floor in case there is a self-sacrifice room. I, I, like, this is probably the last place that we can find one. What are you hitting? Are you hitting the poops? It, it's actually a bit of a synergy if it hits the poops because the poops will act as like chain lightning targets to hit. You know, the poops will chain the damage to other other enemies. Well, that was dumb. More HP. So we're already back at full health. And there's even more HP on the ground. So I really, really would like there to be a self-sacrifice room so that we could get into that Mega Satan fight. Don't forget your recall ability. Nah. Yeah, like the chain lightning, it seems like it's it's passing through the poops. It's pretty good. Come back to me. <laughs> Come back to me. Come back to me, body. All right, let's go fight Mega Satan. He's gonna be freaking dead. Yeah, this is so much better than the last run we had down here. What was the last run we had down here? Also, a uh, a forgotten run when we had nine lives and we were just like completely dying. Cause like that was easy as heck. <laughs> How bad was the last run that we had down to Mega Satan? 
Or not to Mega Satan, but this Satan, rather. Nothing! You're not gonna give me anything? Well, I guess we need to rely on something spawning on the next floor. Unless we can get, like, a Joker card. Oh no, even if we get a Joker card, it's not gonna work because we've already taken a deal with the devil. We took it on the last floor, because that was the last floor for deals anyways. Hmm. The Liquidator, welcome to the stream. Hope you're having a good time. Good to hear that you are. Um, but I guess, I guess we're gonna, I guess we're just gonna go do Satan, which is still an acceptable run. It gives us an excuse to play as this character again, and you know, finally you're gonna pay out. And then we're a fun character to play this time around because we actually had some like good synergies and items, <laughs> as opposed to some of the other times. Super Greed, hey Super Greed. Uh, thank you for the quarter. You know, second secret room. Angel statue. Pills. Golden pill. Luck. Luck up. Hematemesis. Pretty fly. Question mark. Perks. I don't really wish there was a self-sacrifice room on this floor. Shot speed up. Pheromones. Amnesia. Relax. Health down. Retrovision. Verp. What a verb. Luck up? That's pretty good. Tears up! Feels like I'm walking on sunshine. Addicted. What makes you larger? And the Demesis, are you a wizard? Range up! X lax, retrovision, something's wrong. Bombs are key, X lax. I found pills and ate them. Power pill! Pretty fly. Yo, what the heck? One makes you larger, speed down. I can see forever, pretty fly. I found pills, power pill, stompy. Feels like I'm walking on sunshine infested. Explosive diarrhea, shot speed up, infested. Bombs are key, verp. Another luck up. Oh, that was the last of the pill. Aw. Well, that's okay. Just use that, I guess. Uh, all right. No, get, uh, don't go down to freaking delirium. We've already done it. Get out. Go down to the dark path. I was assuming Forgotten would be the hardest and awkward to play, but you make it look easy. Oh, no, no, no! I think this is just a lucky run. <laughs> twins. I haven't I haven't seen Twins before. That's just good, because you get Azazel's Rage, but maybe we'll take them both. We'll start with the Twins. Double Trouble. Conjoined. Okay. That looks amazing, by the way. Look at that. That's cool. I also have two Twin Familiars that also have bones. That looks cool. Uh, yeah, we'll, we'll, let's get some health back first. Dude, I, I don't know if this is a bug, but the slow recall is actually really awesome. The slow recall is kicking ass. I got no idea what Double Trouble does, but I think it's just familiars. It's like Incubus Familiars, but they're always next to you instead of in your familiar chain. <laughs> Hold on, I'm gonna wait. And... Yeah, when you throw a bone through the prism, it just stops. It just doesn't do anything. It just vanishes. It's gone. I actually kind of really like this because by the time Recall wears out because it's trying to bring the body back to you, it's already recharged because it recharges very quickly. That's a that's such a fun item. Tech. What? Dude, let me get into Mega Satan. <laughs> I made a mistake not getting the key pieces earlier. I recognize that. Let me get in now. This is too good of a run. <laughs> We've got seven luck. Come on. 
I don't even think Red Key will do it. Red, you know, Red Key could do it. We would just have to um, find an angel statue in the Red Key rooms. Bumbo and my reflection. I don't think my reflection does anything, so I think it's funny to take. Queen of Hearts, just hearts. Your font. I'm actually gonna leave Bumbo behind because if we get a reroll of some sort, I would like to reroll that. This is an extremely powerful run now, all of a sudden. We just need a key piece to spawn so we can actually do what we want to do. Do Eden's blessing again? It's not quite two runs in a row, but it's close. I love getting all these chests. Makes me think that maybe we got a chance. Eternal feather, not what we want. Well, regardless, let's start by killing the lamb. Oh my god. I like the homing shots when we are inside of a, of a poop. No, you entered the chest, you idiot! Oh, even if we had the key piece, it wouldn't have mattered! <laughs> Stop going into the chest when he's in the middle of the room! <laughs> Polished bone has appeared in the basement. So in the end, it doesn't even matter because we would have accidentally jumped down into the chest anyways. It's not the first time it's happened. Last time it happened with the cathedral portal. And I will point out that it looks like it does not happen with trap doors and womb portals. It looks like those stay shut if the forgotten lands on them, but for some reason the cathedral portal and the chests, maybe even the void portals, it seems like if you if you end the boss fight where they spawn, you just get sucked up immediately or after like a, a second. So there's no time to get away from it because you have to go pick up your body. Although I could have recalled, I just didn't think that it would actually go down the chest. Even though I said it, I just kind of forgot about recall for a second there. But even if we had the key piece, it wouldn't matter. But that was still a fun run. Recall is, in a, is a really fun item. That's, uh, the birthright for the Forgotten is something that I'm gonna try to get whenever it shows up because that is, that is really cool. It was also just a really strong run, which I'm very happy for. Anyways, like usual, I think we learned a lot. So for those of you on YouTube, thank you very much for watching. Like the video if you've enjoyed it, subscribe for more. Check me out on Twitch for when I go live. Support me on Twitch, Patreon, and Streamlabs, and I hope to see you here again for the next run of The Binding of Isaac Repentance.